I don't know if you know this, but it's 2023, and we're about to play a season, okay? I was thinking about um, last year and what I said at the beginning of last year, and I think I said probably every single day for weeks, beginnings are messy. Remember me talking about that? And I said that because our team at the time was brand new. So when I was thinking about this season, I was thinking about the success from last season, and it was for sure a successful season. Um, but I was thinking about how do, how do programs respond to that? You know, what, what are the things that are gonna happen the next year? What are the uh, opportunities that are available to you and us? And then what are the things that are potentially challenges for us, okay? And then what are the expectations for us going forward in light of that, okay? So I love this quote. You guys have probably heard it. You've probably seen it on some coach's board before. You've read it somewhere. Some teacher has talked about it in class, okay? But, uh, you know, I've got to quote a philosopher at some point in my life when I'm a coach, right? That's my background. So I'll read it to you. Actually, I'm not going to read it to you. Who's going to volunteer to read it? Excellent is an art won by training in habituation. Okay. We do not act rightly because we have virtue or excellence, but we rather have these because we have acted rightly. We are what we repeatedly do. Excellence, then, is not in act, but in habit. This was about, this is in his book about the ethics, right? How to have an excellent life, how to be excellent, how to act the right way, okay? But it can apply to anything that you're doing. So excellence in volleyball, all right? It's, it, it's something that's won by training and habituation. We don't, we're not excellent in volleyball because we're already excellent somehow. We're not born with it. We don't show up with it. That, that isn't how we become excellent, all right? Is that it's already there and then we play excellently. It's the other way around. It's that you have to do something the right way day after day after day after day, okay? All right, welcome to first practice. Okay, um, this is what you guys came up with last night. Those are the final ones, okay? Accountability, growth were the performance ones, okay? Respect and trust were the other ones, okay? I think these are great. I think they're awesome, okay? I think a team that has those five things up there is a really fun team to play for that's gonna achieve a lot, okay? and. Um, it's just going to be really good teammate relationships, and it should be a really, really good year. Arms are straight, they're down, they're relaxed. And then listen, it's okay to swing your arms, all right? Swinging your arms is what adds force to the ball. If somebody's ripping a ball at you, you are not going to swing your arms, right? They're just going to be here. If you're passing a little short ball, you're probably just going to look like that. But if you're passing a long distance, out of system set, you're gonna look like that, all right? Because that's where all the force is gonna come from, okay? All right, here we go. The best passers are making reads when the ball is almost still on the hand of the person, all right? It's certainly when it's like a foot or two away, they already have a good idea, all right? And how do we know they're reading well? I know they're reading well because they're already pushed off in the direction that the serve is going that soon, okay? So that's how early we're trying to read. They're changing when you pull them up. They're starting to close and they're starting to open and that's why it's doing that. Shape, shape. Who wants to demo serving for us? Jackie, go. Sydney, go. Look at the target, load, deep breath, go. Okay, nice. Off to the target, hit to the target. Everything is at the target, okay? Do we understand what we're trying to do here? Let's go. I love it, I love it, that's, your, that's it, okay? Every time. Good. We need to understand the level of practice, okay? There is a level, all right, and it's up here, and the level is I'm physically ready to go, all right? Sprinting as hard as I can. I am mentally completely engaged all the time in an open gym with coaches here, without coaches here. It's always like that, okay? Especially if it's something we can control. All right, three, one, two, three. All right.